What's up, I'm Brian here, doing another video for you guys, and this time we've got even more Transformers Generations listings, so let's go ahead and dive right into it. So these are going to be Canadian price tags, but I will try and help out those who can't figure out what the Canadian prices of certain figures are. So the first thing we have listed is a Transformers Generations collab. This is number five listed, but don't take that as in like the fifth one that we already have in the collaboration line. I imagine this is probably going to be a smaller figure like the Back to the Future car. I don't know if it's going to be a G.I. Joe crossover or something, but yes, we are apparently going to get another collaborative figure. I imagine maybe during PulseCon we'll be able to see it, but maybe it will be held off for a future event. We'll just have to wait and see. Anyways, moving on, we also have a Generation Selects figure for $35.99, which is the Deluxe Class price point. If I were to guess on anything, I'm kind of hoping that it's Reboost because we got the Skids mold, but it could be something else. I know that we already have Kickback and there was a Diaclone repaint of that, so maybe there's ties to that. I guess we'll just have to wait and see, but I'm going to guess and say Reboost we kind of need at some point. And last but not least is a Generation Selects 2, which is listed as $299.99, which is the Titan class price point, or at least for the Metroplex. Now, a lot of people are pointing to the Omega Supreme and the Guardian Robot or Omega Sentinel because we've had that tease before. And personally, I think that's probably what they're going for. But I'm also going to throw in another name. Maybe Metro Titan could come out in the Selects line. I know that a lot of people want him in Shattered Glass, but maybe... The Selects line is probably a little more appropriate. I don't know because we haven't had a Shattered Glass figure that big, but we've had Titans that big in Selects. Take, for example, the Black Zerik. So I think that as a follow-up, that fit nicely. But personally, I'm going to guess it's going to be the Omega Sentinel. So what do you guys think? Please comment below. Let me know. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and all those fun doodads. And I'll see you guys next time. All Spark TV. Now that's just Prime.